Hi guys, welcome to the channel of love. I never do a reading standing up. Anyway, I was just trying to make a video call. They didn't answer. And as I kind of stepped back, it was like, I'm going to do a video. We're going to have a reading. It's like, how much daily guidance do you need every day? Some days a lot, maybe. More than others, depending on what's going on. I just saw the focus on service card. That's most definitely what I am doing. If I feel called to come on, I was just about to do like some washing up. Okay. <clears throat> I feel drawn to come on then here I am right let's get you a little message what do we want to um what do we want to have guidance on it's perfect timing okay that's cool now is the perfect moment for you to act on your inspirations okay so <clears throat> your inspirations when you're in spirit you're inspired What's inspiring you at the moment? Because now is the perfect moment for you to act on your inspirations. The doors are the doors are open while you walk through them with us by your side. Don't delay or procrastinate as all of the ingredients are ripe for your success. Everything and everyone is on your side, supporting your positive outcome. It took me to be me being in the kitchen. And kind of like, you're by my side, you're going to help me to cook? Okay, we've got a bit of washing up to do first. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, doing my chores, my housework. Okay, perfect timing. <clears throat> energy work. Do you want to help me? Okay, I can feel you here in energy. It says life can be electrifying because its very essence is energy. Your body is a remarkable energy field that will positively respond to loving treatments. Your hands and heart are activated to give healing energy to your loved ones and clients. Take me to a helping hand. So I'm really feeling the energy here. Of, you're never alone. Okay. It's bloody King of Swords. You're never walk you'll never walk do the washing up do the cooking alone we are going for a walk later but we have to wait until it's dark and then we've got to go and do like a uh, a trip around the woods um just to see if everything's a-okay three of pentacles look at this working in partnership with like-minded people it's cooperation let's read it because it says, now is the perfect moment for you to act on your inspirations. Like you knew it. What, you knew I was pottering around in the kitchen? I was actually looking for company. Whilst I was doing my washing up. Like making a video call. I was going to say to him, do you fancy chatting to me? Whilst I do the washing up. True story. True story. And they didn't answer, so I'm spending it with you. You are collaborating with others and creating synergies to achieve big results. You balance the wisdom of the experts and the new ideas of the novices. Okay, I'm looking forward to spending some time with you. See what your ideas are then. Hey, you better knock, knock, knock on wood. Baby. Ooh, 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 ooh. Baby. Why are we heartbroken? Because we can't be there in uh in presence but you can be there in the heart in spirit it picked that up on that little bible passage it says something about um it was like about the loss even though it was like the loss of your presence but never in the heart okay don't lose hope that's what it takes me to don't lose hope three of um swords so we've got three of pentacles and the three of swords now add them together and you've got like harmony, balance, bliss. So in oh, in the end, in the beginning, in the end, the Divine Masculine doesn't want you to feel sad. He's here to help you. He's energetically with you. And vice versa. Three of Swords. You are feeling hurt and disappointed taking others' negative words to heart. You feel lost heartbreak, grief and sorrow. This will pass. Work on releasing the pain and forgiving those who have hurt you. Ooh. 
voice message. I wanted a video call with them. I got a voice message. It's all good. It's all meant to be. So I feel like this energy of <clears throat> actually feeling the divine masculine. You're tapping into seeing, you're seeing what the divine feminine's up to. Okay, because you want to be around her energy. It's perfect timing. It feels like she's in this beautiful energy to be receptive. Okay, receptive to sharing. So the divine feminine sharing her heart space with you. It feels like um, you're like a lost little shadow. Should we say that? Let's get one more card. So it's like you're wondering what the divine feminine is up to. Have you had a tough day? It's telling me about listening to a song here. But I've got my phone there. I'd have to go over to the radio. All we hear is radio gaga. Gaga. Goo goo. A lot of baby talk going on. Okay, gibberish. Gibberish. It's 7.20. Let's have a look at what's on the radio. I don't know what station it is. Depends if the kids have been on it, which I think they have. It's Capital. Okay. Capital UK. Let's see. It says service not available. Well, what do we think to that? Let me just move the aerial. Jeez. Okay. I thought like, that technology was well on it, but uh, I'm so sorry, the service is not available. <clears throat> I'll see if I can turn it over. Let's turn it to magic. It's a kind of magic. Let's try magic. See if it will connect us to magic. It's thinking about it. Are you going to connect us? <clears throat> oh, it's playing. There you go. It's a kind of magic. It says playing, but there's no sound as of yet. Okay. Oh, it says service not available. Let's go to Mellow Magic. This is our last attempt, I think. No, it says service not available. Okay, heart. Or do you want a bit of kiss? We can have a look at kiss. Would you like a kiss? Is it going to pick up one of these? No, no kissing. What is it you're after then? Let's go to some heart. Hope. This one called Hope FM. Let's have a look. No. <laughs> Jeez. Home? I'm called home. Oh, then it's thinking about that one. No. We'll finish off with heart. Heart dance? Yeah, we could go to some dance music. What do we reckon about that? It's connecting. No. Sorry guys. Oh, <gasps> did you hear it? It says service was available and then I heard the music. So they're fibbing. The heart wants to dance. Okay, let's leave it. Right, okay. I'm in the mood for dancing, romancing. I don't know whether that's going to go on. It says service not available, but I heard a tune come through. We've got the lovers. Trying to do what lovers do. Let's look at this passion you've got here. All aroused. What am I meant to do with that? Look up, she's saying. <laughs> this is you looking at the divine feminine for guidance and the divine feminine looking to the divine. To the divine for guidance. It's the food chain. Okay. Five of swords. Um... I feel like this is one being a cut above the other. So there's two feminines here. Is this why you're sad? What are you sad about? I feel like you're sad about bringing conflict here. Okay. Uh, nine of cups. Well, are you sad? I'm feeling like you're wanting to be with the Divine Feminine. You've cut something out of your life. Someone's been nasty to you. That's what I feel. I feel like maybe another Feminine's been nasty to you today. And you could do with some of the Divine Feminine's uh, company. 
You'd like to be in her company. Understandable. Uh, the Divine Feminine here, she can kind of sense this, pick up on it. And uh, it's like she knows that uh, she has the ability to make you happy. Would you like a Journey of Love card? I'm going to go and turn the stereo off in case it wants to like scare us to death. Daydream. You will more easily hear and receive our messages if you daydream regularly. Relax and open your mind to receiving without directing your thoughts. Just notice any feelings, visions or ideas as if you were watching a movie. This is a saint. Seat. This is a saint. This is a saint of creativity. So I'm feeling as if in your eyes, your divine feminine, she's a saint. Oh, when the saints go marching in. Oh, when the saints go marching in. What do you want to be? I want to be within that number. When the saints come march. Oh, they're coming marching in now. All together now. Oh, when the saints. Okay, we make our own music. How about that? Let me find these uh, journeys of love. Okay. Sit back. Imagine. Um, it was recommended in, I'm not sure what chapter, maybe chapter two, chapter three of the monk who sold his Ferrari. He speaks about finding that space, that, crea that creative seat to sit in the seat of creation. Okay, you can communicate with your divine feminine. It's like you can actually be there. Drop into your heart. I can take that card. Oh, it's drop into your heart. So, <clears throat> 68. One more step away from a 69er. Lucy, read the card. Well, I can read thoughts as well and minds and energy and tapping noises. A little love heart at my window tapping away. 68. There is a place of light within that no darkness can touch. It cannot be shamed. It can never be made impure. It is never lost or darkened or unavailable to us, though we may forget sometimes, sitting in a darkened room and not realising that we can stand up and walk right into, or we can walk right into the light. It says and walk into the light so close to us, just on the other side of the doorway of the heart. Whatever may arise, great joy, great sorrow, drop into your heart and offer it to the divine, gently bowing your forehead to your hands in prayer. Connect mind to heart. Let yourself have some peace. It wants you, you know. This oracle brings you an offering. The divine would like you to offer whatever is bringing your heart trouble. Where's it gone? Well, we won't go back over it. We already saw the card, didn't we? We did. So this oracle brings you an offering. The divine would like you to offer whatever is bringing your heart trouble. Or, of course, joy. The divine would like to receive this from you as a gift that it may return to you some special blessing. Place your hands at your heart and in genuine reflection, perhaps you may choose to offer your heart burden or light now. Either way, either way, either will be joyfully received by the divine and you shall be graced with a gift in return. I'm here to offer you my light. Longing. The dance to move beyond the feeling. It, want, it wanted to, the heart did want to dance. The dance to move beyond the feeling that draws me forward to a place born within that calls my soul to feel complete. Contemplation. <clears throat> the bottom of the deck. Spiral dance of the goddess. I'm not talking about dancing. You make me feel like dancing. I want to dance another way. 
Let's do it. Let's dance to nine to one. 29. From a point of light unfolding, we become a soul, then incarnate into a sacred body, and our lives become a work of divine art, a speck of heavenly presence manifesting itself through dimensions of time and space, and into a life on earth made manifest. This extraordinary, the extraordinary fact of your existence is a divine happening. As though the light of the moon is dancing not only upon the water, but inside of it, your ancient light is dipping into the mud of the earth. This is how the soul becomes a human. This is how the soul becomes a divine human in the making. As you sense yourself moving and shifting from light to dark and back again, from knowing to unknowing, you are weaving your consciousness, your divinity into sacred expression manifesting your soul essence into the form of your life, threading the light through the darkness without even realising you are doing it. You are gently impregnating the matter of your body, of your life, with light. Your body and your life become luminous, radiant, and you assist others even just through your presence. It sounds wonderful, and it is, yet it is not always an easy path. As the light travels through darkness, pain and suffering can arise in waves. Best to be present to it, trust that it is not a permanent condition, and wait for the spiral to twist from dark to light again, always moving closer and closer to the purity of the centre and expanding outward eternally, as though you are being inhaled by the divine, filling cosmic lungs as they reach far and wide, taking in all of life. Do you remember the guidance I gave you this morning to breathe, get some fresh air? I'm gonna go out later on this evening. The yeah, air's been a bit muggy today. It's sunshiny out there, it's very sticky. It's gonna be best to wait for better results, wait until later on. The message of this oracle to you is that you are growing. You are bringing more of your light into form. You may be meeting obstacles in yourself and in the world but this is because you are bringing through the light. If there were nothing happening, there would be no obstacle. Bless them as signs that you are proceeding and empower them no more. You shall be. All else is just divine timing. Okay, poem, and we're leaving it here. The inner movement, an expressive flow, an outward breath of dance and light, becoming one, becoming free. Okay. I love you all. I'll catch up with you soon. Bye for now.